Hey guys, so today I'm going to do a little review about this overnight mask from FossRx that's really really popular lately so if you guys are interested about which masks that I prefer and why I like them and my thoughts regarding them, please keep watching. So first of all, I'm going to review about the Ultimate Moisturizing Honey Overnight Mask. I have my little note here so if I look like I'm reading something, it's because I probably am because I don't want to miss any points so please just ignore that so yeah I'm just gonna get started before I blabber too much I bought this overnight honey mask like quite a while ago and so like um yeah all the content is practically gone I just left a little bit there so I can do this review so as you guys can see it's a very light honey color it smells really really nice like it's not like a perfumey smell but it's like um light sweet honey smell and the texture of this it's a very very light like watery gel texture it absorbs into the skin immediately you just like pat it into your skin for a while and then your skin will drink it all up and it doesn't leave any residue behind on top of my skin and it really really moisturizes but I think it's more suitable for people who are more oily instead of like if you're really really dry I feel like you this won't be moisturizing enough for you and maybe in the summer and the spring but for the winter even for me and I have oily skin I don't think this is moisturizing enough for me and I also find that this kind of helped like get rid of my acne scar it calms my skin like I'm, I suck at explaining I'm sorry but it really calms my skin and it helps my acne scar to diminish the next morning but it's not a permanent thing, but it's just, it's really nice that I wake up with like a really nice canvas for makeup. So next, I'm going to talk about the Ultimate Nourishing Rice Overnight Spot Mask. This one is my quite recent purchase. I bought it like only a couple of, not a couple, like three, about a month ago, I think. And this one, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's a thicker, more stiff gel-like texture. In my opinion, this is a more heavy-duty version of this so like I think it's more suitable for the colder months and for people who have really really like dry dehydrated skin but even for me oily skin in the colder months like around this time this is very very good for my skin my skin loves these but like compared to this like I said, this is a more heavy-duty version, so it's more moisturizing, which is kind of funny because this has moisturizing on the title. This is nourishing, so I don't know about that, but for me, this one is more moisturizing than the honey one. A little bit goes a long way, so whenever I use this, I would layer like a crap ton of this on my skin and it would just get absorbed nicely. But this one, even a little bit, will leave a little bit of like layer on top of your skin, like a sticky layer, like a moisturizing layer. For this time of the month, I love it. And so I don't use this under my makeup. I only use this at night as the last step of my skincare to like lock everything in. And it, yeah, like I mentioned, it does leave a residue behind. So keep that in mind if you want to purchase this. So if you guys are curious which one I prefer from these, I feel like they're good for different type of situation and different types of skin. Like I said, if you have oily skin and it's like summer or in the beginning of like fall or the end of spring when it's cold but not that cold I would get this one because it's light it's moisturizing it doesn't clog my pore it doesn't break me out it's it absorbs into my skin completely it sits well under makeup so I would probably buy this again in the summer months however for this one like I mentioned I would prefer it for the winter months because it's very moisturizing a little bit goes a long way don't use too much guys, I mean it, I had to rewash my face because I used too much of these and I couldn't stand how sticky it was. It leaves a residue on top of your skin so keep that in mind. Thank you guys so much for watching, I know this is not a very long video but I hope it was helpful and informative so if you guys like this video please give this video a thumbs up and if you guys want to watch any of my other video please click on either one on the screen and yeah. Please subscribe to my channel if you're interested to see more of my content. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!